laboratory. What up, YouTube? Merry Christmas, you filthy animals. Christmas was yesterday. Had a great Christmas. I hope everyone else had a great Christmas and a happy holidays. Contest winner was The Dom. You get a coffee mug. Congrats on that. He chose the name Dee Dee from Dexter's Laboratory. I think that's very fitting considering that I am a scientist. So great choice, great, good name, love it. And now I'm out on the bike with my new gear. Look at this. This is Dionysi. Gloves, winter gloves, no more freezing my hands off. No more under gloves, no more snowboarding gloves. I got official winter motorcycling gloves. From my sister, how nice. And then from my mom, I got some nice leather pants. So now that makes two motorcycling pants I have. I have like a textile pair that kind of look like jeans and then now I have these nice leather ones. Kind of weird how they get used to it. They don't have so much mobility. I guess the leather has to wear down on them. I'll link all my uh, new clothes in the description. You guys want to check them out if you like, like the look of them. I like these winter gloves. I mean, they're like a hundred and something dollars for the gauntlets for uh, for these guys, but like they are like really flexible. I really like them. The leather pants, they're all right. They don't zip into my jacket, which is kind of sad. Like the zipper goes the opposite way for some reason. All I have is like the little loops. So you have little loops in your jacket that connect your pants to your jacket. So I can do that still, but there's no place for a belt with this jacket. So it's kind of, I don't know. I just like, if I ever crash, I hope they just don't slide off and my bare ass is running, running against the asphalt. So that would be pretty bad. But they are perforated. So I don't think they're really good for a uh, winter I'm kind of my thighs are getting pretty cold it'd be nice in the summertime because leather gets really hot in the summertime so the preparation in the thighs would be nice so you don't get swamp swamp ass well I wasn't just recording but I almost hit a deer um, and this chain is gonna take forever this is I'm next to Harper's Ferry right now and this is the CNO canal this is gonna take a while I give up Oh my goodness, my bike wouldn't start there for a second. It's odd. A Didi, no. My laboratory. Hi, Dexter! Didi, what are you doing in my laboratory? And ready, set, go. JK. Mm hmm, hmm. I have to get used to these pants. I don't know, they're kind of weird. I can't, like when I put my feet down, I don't know, they stretch weird. Just have to break them in, I think. I'm about to go over the Potomac right now. Don't know where I'm headed. I think I'm gonna go down 233. It's a really nice uh, highway with mountains next to it. I'm not sure of the mountain range, but I know it's the Appalachian Trail. The Potomac. So this is Point of Rocks. And now, I am in Virginia. So beautiful. So decided to turn around, not turn around, but take a different way back because it's like 35 degrees out right now and I am actually freezing. I mean, the sun is not out right now, so kind of sucks even with all this winter gear on I'm still still pretty cold but I needed to get out I needed to test it needed to test this new gear and also I'm not gonna be able to ride for a while because I'm going to be working down in Virginia all during the weekday and I'll be back in Frederick on the weekend so this is super pretty anyways Thanks guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.